I am Paul Levy. I was law school 1972. Penn's been great to me and uh, I've done my best to reciprocate, so I'm excited. The exciting thing about being at the law school is realizing how powerful the law is in our lives, in everybody's life, whether you're a lawyer or not. And so realizing that, you know, it infiltrates every aspect of what you do has really made it very exciting for me. One of the comments in my short talk will be that I think Penn has really stayed true to its mission and its vision and has not swerved as some others have. So I think, uh, you know, Penn deserves a lot of credit. Amy and her team deserve a lot of credit. I think the school's on the right path and uh, onward and upward. Alan Levin, class of the College of 64. It's uh, very nice to be remembered by your school after all these years. I had great experiences here. I have great friends. My son went to school here. The memories stay with you forever. The young men and the young women that I interview uh, really want to come to Penn. Not everybody can come there, but um, uh, they want, you have to give them uh, a first class job and their first class uh, men and women, uh, very intelligent, and they deserve the best. Uh, William Mack, Wharton 61. It's a great honor, I'm very proud of it. But the, the real honor goes with all of the people who are here tonight, all of the people who have made this school great, and I'm just standing in for them. Penn does great things. The, the things that they do for their students, the way they teach, the courses they teach, the faculty that they have, the diversity that they have, the high ethics that they instill in people is just a terrific thing. I've been back on campus a lot over the last 35 years, so it always feels great when I'm back on campus. My name is Janie Davis Pearlstein Wharton 80. I am humbled, first of all, because I know many people who have gotten this award before me, and to be in the same class that they are in is just humbling, and I'm very excited, very, very excited to be here and to be recognized. I feel that all of us have gotten so much from the university that it's important to give back. So for me, being a member of Trustees Council of Penn Women, I felt very gratified making an impact on students today and giving back to them. And then through my class, uh, I also have worked with the Sayre High School and hopefully I'm making an impact on their lives too. So I feel like the, the greatest gift of all was when I got into Penn, that it's only natural for me to feel that I need to give back. My name is Esan Altari, that was my maiden name, College for Women 73, but my nickname is Nanu, my married name is Zion. So half the people call me Nanu Zion. <laughs> I really didn't expect it and I feel utterly overjoyed and humbled by it. I say connected to Penn very simply because I had had such an extraordinarily wonderful memory of my Penn years. And in London, we had about two decades ago an alumni event and it just reminded me of my wonderful years. I'd been a bit out of touch in the interim and I just wanted to leap in again and it was uh, fantastic. I'm Julie Baron platt a graduate of the class of 1979. It's been a wonderful honor. It's also been an opportunity to meet people across the classes, across the schools, to travel around the country and meet Penn alums. I've had a wonderful time so far. I love recognizing people who value their Penn education and then want to give back. I think it's a wonderful model as an alum of what it means to be grateful and I love that we recognize it. The experience that I had at Penn has been multiplied by my experience as an alum. It just continues and grows. And you don't just stay connected to your class, you stay connected to people who feel about Penn the way you do. 